Hello and welcome to Prime News. Let's take a look at the headlines. We eat poison every day. Investigation by Prudent reveals how our favourite green peas sold in packets is adulterated with harmful chemicals. No sign of third front idea materialising. Most of the proponents undecided. BJP tries to woo Saval Rohan after Don's exit. Mystery car parked in Taligaon from last four days. Sources claim car belongs to suspended RTO officer Gawas, parked to avoid ACP detection. Nineteen Goans stranded on their way back from Amarnath Yatra after landslide in Kashmir, all safe and sound, shifted to army camp. And FIR against government's officials for failure to take timely action to prevent the outbreak of dengue in Sanjo's the Ariel Resolves village. Now the news in detail. We eat poison every day. Rather we buy it ourselves. It is sold to us as an ingredient in our healthy food. Investigation by Prudent has revealed how our favourite green peas sold in packets for 10 to 20 rupees are not necessarily green. They are highly adulterated and coloured by using harmful chemicals like malachite green, a green poison fed to earn few more bucks. A special expose. We are in the Panjim Municipal Market and uh, we are trying our luck on this green peas. I have already picked one packet of green peas uh, which cost me around 20 rupees. Air is mutter saloon. Bizarre. It's not bizarre. It's not And I also have this fresh green peas which is also locally known as mutter. But how do we check? Uh, which one is real and which one is not adulterated and all. So we have your uh, bottle full of water and what we are going to do is just open the packet and pour it in the bottle. And now we will try with this also whether the colour of the piece change and the water colour also change. Add the peas in the water. So this is the outcome of the green peas. Consumers declared the outcome. This is the water ne, with colour and this is the one without colour. So, I mean this is the one that is naturally found. This is what we are getting now, this is not the season for it. I mean, off season, this is what they sell. But this food color isn't good for him. We should go for this one. Ha, color green is not good. It's not normal. 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 the sellers say that they are not aware about the source of vegetable. Following Prudence report, FDA conducted raid at Ponda Market and seized more than six cages of green peas. Hi, I declared that. I mean, green peas, colored victim, complaint. 
चण्याची ड्राय म्हाज्या आता आमच्या ऑफिस तर्फे चालूच उरतलो कित्याक ते सगळ्या बाजारांनी ऑलमोस्ट सगळ्यात विकता अशी आमकां इन्फॉर्मेशन मेळा ते कलर घालता म्हणजे ते एक अपियरन्स वाढपा खातीर आणि बरे दिसता न्ही तेका लागून लोक घेता म्हणजे कलर बरो न्ही घालप अनहायजीन So this is it a green poison in our food plate but you can avoid it by being more alert buy green peas pod or eat shell green peas and you can save your family from the poison bureau report prudent there is nothing concrete about the much hyped third front third front aspirants are assessing political repercussions of their move Assembly election is just one and a half years away and the third front has remained just an idea a proposal sources say most of the proponents are undecided the situation has become complex after the exit of BJP organizing secretary Satish Don from Goa BJP is now trying to woo Saval and other independent MLAs a special report third front conceptualization had taken place almost 6 months back but there is no mahurat for foundation stone laying for this alternate political outfit the politician supporting the third front seems on back foot third front means vijay sardesai naresh sawar and rohan khauti this is the common perception one gets when third front is visualized congress mla alex rajinald and bjp mla michael lobo are also seen flirting with the idea michael lobo has already discarded any possibility of joining the third front lobo is compelled to maintain such a stand as he is ruling mla but his close associates say lobo hasn't decided anything yet they are not ruling out he's staying with bjp also congress mla alex rajinald is regularly seen with vijay sardesai but rajinald is also not sure about his third front entry rajinald has announced his plan during a function in satri if congress allots tickets to fresh faces he will be there with the party but if it gives tickets to all the corrupt heavyweights he will quit Naresh Sawar says third front is essential but so is close to Naresh Sawar inform that he too has not decided anything yet Sawar advocates third front idea but his political inclinations are towards the MGP Ron Khote is firm on an alternate political outfit Khote is upset with the Congress corrupt history and incumbent government's way of ruling and finally Vijay Sardesai the pioneer of the third front proposal Vijay Sardesai agrees that nothing is crystallized he maintains third front is still an idea ye aaj ye idea ave phude gadille pure lokane decision geung jay lokane phude sarung jay lokancho pakshi jao pay jay goyant ata to mojo pakshi aspasa na ata hau ta jo ek main spokesman asung shakta but technically hau ta kon join jatlo o ta mojo role kire astalo that is not as yet defined so at the moment it is an idea but an idea can change the world खूब गोष्टी जाऊंक शकता आणि ते आयडिया एक करंट आहा लोकांक दिसता की हे एक पोटंट आयडिया असा आणि मला दिसता सपोर्ट खूप कडच्यान येऊपक लागला आता आमदार कितले आहा वो आमदार कितले ना हो इशू ना दिस इज नॉट अबाउट आमदार आताच्या आमदारांचा आमका इंटरेस्ट ना आमका असा इंटरेस्ट चड फाल्याचे आमदार जातले तसले लोकांक तातून थोडे आमदार जे हंगा असत अंजल भी मुझे दिता तपोर्ट आसा भी उलोपा लगे पुण एट द मोमेंट द आइडिया हेज नॉट क्रिस्टलाइज इन टू समथिंग वीच इज लाइक अ फ्लड एंड आई थिंक दैट विल कम समे ऑर दर बट एज पोस इज आफ्टर द ट्रांसफर ऑफ बीजेपी ऑर्गनाइजिंग सेक्रेटरी सतीश धोन पोलिटिकल इक्वेशन हैव चेंज बीजेपी लीडर्स आर ट्राइंग टू रोप इन नरेश सावर एंड रोहन खवटे नाउ इट इज टू बी सीन वेद द धोन एक्जिट विल ब्रिंग सावर एंड खवटे क्लोज टू द सेफरन पार्टी as both staunchly oppose his dictatorial methods of functioning in such circumstances it is to be seen whether third front really materializes or it just remains an idea with savio dai senior reporter lokik shilkar for prudent corrupt rto officer oday gawas owned suv has been parked at taligaon so that the acb does not track it down Sources claim that the Renault Duster belongs to the RTO assistant director Uday Gawas and it might have been brought from his ill-gotten wealth. Police had raided his house on Thursday, 4 days past. This Duster is parked in the same venue in Taligaon. Sources in RTO also confirm that the car belongs to their suspended colleague. Taligaon is a buzz with discussions over a Renault Duster number GA05D4599. This duster has been parked near Hotel La Rose for the past 4 days. Sources informed that this vehicle belongs to corrupt RTO assistant director Uday Gaus. 
but he has purchased the vehicle in someone else's name. Vehicle was parked at this location to avoid detection during raid on the residence of Gauss. ACB of Vigilance Department raided both houses on Thursday and seized some documents. Vehicle escaped the clutches of ACB. Prudent team visited the spot. People say they have no clue who parked the vehicle, but it is stationed there for last four days. People also say that the vehicle belonged to corrupt RTO officer Uday Gauss. When Prudent contacted RTO sources, they also confirmed that the vehicle belongs to Uday Gauss. If the vehicle belongs to Uday Gauss, the Vigilance has a tough job to crack on Uday Gauss's other hidden and parked assets at various places. Bureau report prudent. It's time for a short break. Stay tuned.